Well, how do that, chum? So today, chums, I'm going to be looking at and reviewing The Brother's Son over on Netflix. Now, I've watched all of season one, all eight episodes. In the background right now is the trailer playing on my big old TV here. Yeah? So if you want to see the original with all of the audio, I'll put a link inside of the video description. It's awesome. I really enjoyed this. I really enjoyed season one, and I'm hoping that season two comes out and comes over to Netflix. It's basically a story of two brothers, one that's grown up over in Taipei, and he's sort of like second in command of the triads and he killed somebody at the age of 14 using a chair leg so his nickname is chair leg <laughs> pretty awesome and his brother grew up over in LA as an improv actor of all things and they come together and all hell breaks loose inside of LA it's got some very memorable characters in it I've already mentioned the cast being fantastic and it is it's very much on point all the choreography freaking great awesome very believable the body mechanics are there everything's there and it just all sort of slots in and it's quite clever. The actual scripting is great as well and very adult themed. There's a lot of violence inside of this and it kept me interested from episode one all the way through to episode eight. There's a few twists and turns in there. There's some awesome characters that actually do perish. Everybody is not safe in this and there's some real surprise deaths in it as well. So yeah, I would highly, highly recommend you hit up Brother's Son and give it a try. And there are some elements where you have to read a little bit of subtitles, but it's predominantly all in English, American. And yeah, there's only little occasions where you have to read a little couple of, of, of subtitles. And it's a very believable and very likable series. You kind of feel a kinship to a lot of the actual characters in this. And you can see that there are bonds there. I bet there were some awesome bonds off camera as well inside of this. I'd like to see the bloopers reel for it, for example. But yeah, awesome. I mean, the main guy, who, you know, the, the triad sort of son, uh, the chap there, he does baking. I mean, it starts off inside of his hotel and inside like his condo apartment, and he's watching the Great British Bake Off when some people break into his house and he completely mullers them and his, his bacon gets burnt. It's actually, there's some actual laugh out loud moments during some extreme elements of violence. It, it's, it's got everything this. If you're looking for something to watch on Netflix, it's something to watch and it's bloody good. If I had to give it a rating out of 10, I would score this. I'm going to give it a 10. I'm going to give this a 10 out of 10. I freaking loved it. Can't rate for season two. Bring it on Netflix. Heck yes. That's why we subscribe. Oh, until next time, people. Goodbye, goodbye. And goodbye again.